Hello and welcome to BOW, back here again with another LEGO review. Today we are taking a look at LEGO Ninjago Poly Bag number 30650, Kai and Raptin's Temple Battle. Now this contains 47 pieces. I do believe it is technically supposed to retail for $4.99 as pretty much every poly bag I've ever seen has. Um, but where I buy my poly bags from, they mark them up. And they are the only place to buy poly bags from where I live. So I paid $7 plus tax. So let's take a look at the set. So it only contains 47 pieces and is a pretty simple set. Now I'm going to admit right away I do not know much about Lego Ninjago. I know that it's very popular um, and it's probably one of their longest running um sets that is their own ip that's like outside of you know just random city sets and stuff in fact this might be their longest running ip set um this set came out in 2023 it comes with two minifigures we do have one of the ninjas who is kai and who i just knocked over and you can see that he comes with his full ninja garb and then he comes with this special armor that lets him hold his swords in place. Now, I am not usually one for Legos having things around their neck or any type of armor, but it's pretty cool to see it with holding the swords. And then we do have Raptin, who appears to be partially cyborg. Um, again, I don't know much about Ninjago. Now, he has a cool orange sword that is kind of translucent. And he also has his own armor. And again, I just really don't like the armor. I have it on right now because I'm showing you, of course, what comes with the set. But I really much prefer his printing that's on his torso and legs compared to this boring armor. Then you do have the temple where they seem to be battling over this golden dagger. As you can see, this is... Not really a temple, it's more of a shrine, if anything. Um, it's a very small build. You do, of course, get a frog, because what is a Lego set without a frog? And it's a nice golden one. And a golden dagger. And not really any other pieces that I find unique. Maybe there's something here that catches your eye, that, you know, is something you've been wanting but really, I just have a ton of the rest of these pieces, and they all seem pretty normal to me right now. However, overall, given that this comes with two minifigures, um, you know, it comes with four weapons, and of course, the obligatory frog, I'm going to give this an 8 out of 10. The minifigures are really what make this set for me, um, and I do love the printing on this guy right here. So as soon as I get done with this, I'm probably going to take his armor off, just so I can show the full printing when I have him on display or in my own creations. And the ninja costume that comes with it is also just amazing. It has some pretty good printing itself. So overall, that is all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, hey, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. It really helps me out a lot. And I will see you guys next time with a brand new LEGO video.